Okay, welcome to the next training video. In this one, what we're going to do is actually select a product to go ahead and promote. So now that we've established a niche to enter, we need to find a product to promote and ensure we can find the key phrases to target as well. So to find a product to promote, you simply need to look at different affiliate marketplaces and select one that is in your niche, right? It's got to be selling well, has good stats like EPCs and other stats that you are given. You may have already discovered some good product names that seem popular in your niche research. Now that's the first place I would start. So there are going to be hundreds of different places to look, but some of my favorite ones are ClickBank. Now ClickBank's almost the most popular one out there. So you can find a product in every single niche on earth in ClickBank. Okay, so that is multi-niche. And Warrior Plus is more internet marketing and that is an, an excellent marketplace as well. You've got JVZoo, once again, internet marketing there as well. BlueSnap, all sorts of different stuff in there. Um, more like parenting, software, all that sort of stuff. Avangate, Avangate, once again, multi-niche, get lots of different products in there as well. You do have to sign up and be approved. Now, More Niche, More Niche is excellent. It's fairly new. It's got a lot of health products in there. Uh, I do like More Niche as well. You've got Neverblue. Neverblue is another one that I do use. Not very often, but I do use it. Pay.com, very good, very popular. Share a sale, plus there's plenty more. Okay, so what I'm going to actually do is I'll add a list below this video of all the different marketplaces that I can, you know, I can find and, you know, ones that you can use uh, and many more that you can go ahead and try as well. So when looking through these marketplaces, I usually list down the top five products for each marketplace to research a little bit further. So you want to make sure you go into your niche, you go, you go into that niche, you look at the top five products in that particular niche and you jot them down on a, on a notepad, piece of paper, whatever it may be. Just jot down the actual names of the products, the top five products that have got the best stats and actually are converting the best in that niche that you're after. So once you've gone ahead and done this, so you've gone ahead and you've selected a product, written down all those top five products, and you've gone ahead and narrowed it down to a minimum of a few products, I want you to move on to the next training video where I'm going to actually show you how to find the key phrase to focus our whole campaign on. Okay, so now we need to go ahead and actually find the products, okay, um, because we need to get the key phrase that's going to go along with that product, of course, and that'll be in the next video. So to do that, it's really quite simple. You would have already found some and written some down, okay? So that's the very first place to start. So you want to get those products that you hopefully wrote down. So I'm going to go and get them now and write them down. Now I went for, what was it, health and fitness, I went for remed remedies, the top five, the diabetes lie, diabetes loophole, natural pure natural healing. Okay, so I'm going to drop these down. I usually just do a little document like this. I've got a little notepad. So my niche is health and fitness, remedies, skin remedies. Okay, uh, marketplace, ClickBank, top product names. Okay, so regardless of the fact that skin remedies is the one I want to do, but it might not be enough there for me. So I'm going to go down and write down the ones that I found. So I'll do that now. Okay, so now that I've got them all written down, that's the top product names that I, I found there in ClickBank underneath my particular uh, niche that I'm interested in. Okay, so now what I would do is I would go to another marketplace and I would do the same. So that could be any, any there's multiple different ones and I have um, provided a list of different ones. Just to give you a quick look, you know, there's Avangate, obviously ClickBank, uh, Plymouth, there's Neverblue, ClicksGlore, Snapshot, uh, MoreNiche, Pay.com, Share a sales good. Um, what's another one? It's really quite good. Uh, Global Matrix is good. Zax is good. Um, yeah, so there's quite a few and they're endless. Okay, now to find some if you do not have any, uh, one simple way to do that, what you do is you just type in, say for instance, your niche is uh, pet care. So pet care affiliate marketplaces. Okay. And then you've got pet, pet affiliate programs, welcome to our affiliate network. You've got lots and lots and lots to choose from, right? And you can do that for any niche. You just type your niche in there, affiliate marketplaces, and you'll find them. Okay, very simple to do. Now, once you've done that and you've written down and jotted down all the top five from all the different ones on a notepad, okay, then what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to remove some of the ones that are just completely common names, okay, things that you'll never never convert in it when it comes to advertising. Okay, so things like, uh, these are all okay. Diabetes, lie, the diabetes loophole. Now they're borderline, pure natural healing. Now that there, I would probably get rid of that because the word pure natural healing is gonna be in a you know Twitter posts and blog posts and it's gonna be the titles of things. It could be targeted to all sorts of different people. 
all sorts of different people okay they're after natural healing pure natural healing but there's, that's a very vast niche within itself so I would probably remove that one okay so I would probably remove that one and I'll just change some numbers here and the rest of these ones are okay because they've got like unique names they're not like um, and psoriasis revolution and it's a bit borderline but that might be okay okay so the diabetes lie the diabetes loophole heartburn and more fungus keep pro okay fantastic now what we want to do now is you want to move on to the next video so in the next video we're going to go ahead and we're going to use these names now to try and find a key phrase or two that's going to stand out that's a problem based okay so what's a good idea to do now is to sort of think to yourself okay what would be a couple of questions I would have now some of the questions I would have is one does the diabetes lie work that is one of the main ones I would look at targeting when we do our research other things would be like um, the actual diabetes lie itself so in other words you could discuss the lie does uh, does diabetes really cause ABC? Does diabetes really cause this, this, and this? Is there a way to really cure diabetes? Um, have I been told a lot about curing diabetes? You know, things like that. So we can target along those lines. So you'll find some of these will be easier than others to look at. Um, but when it comes to research, we'll take care of that in the next in the next video. So move on to that one, and I'll show you exactly how to find the key phrase.